How's it going everybody out there? Coach Mark here and I'm going to try something a little bit different today. So I'm getting ready to go to the gym and um, I wanted to take a pre-workout. I bought this the other day. I had just literally, right before I started recording this video, I had started opening it and I said, let me do a review on it. Um, so if you're not familiar, this is Ignition Switch from Axe and, Axe and Sledge um, Supplements by Seth Ferrosi. Um, if you guys aren't familiar with Seth Ferrosi, check out his videos. He's awesome. I'm a big fan of his. Um, what him and his company stand for, and um, I'm, I'm a big fan of their supplements as well. And I've never tried this particular pre-workout before. This is their stimulant-based uh, pre-workout as opposed to their stim-free workout. So this is going to have the caffeine in it. It's going to have the beta alanine in it, which is typical for most pre-workouts. But what I like about this one in particular is that there's some ingredients here that you typically wouldn't find in your everyday pre-workout that some of the other companies offer. Um, First and foremost, I have to give them credit in always finding uh, patented ingredients to put in their products so that you know the product is going to be a little bit more quality because they're patented products or pat patented ingredients that, um, you know, they, they've been through the, the testings and whatnot. So they're, they're very clean products, which I like. Uh, their protein powders are great. Um, by all means, I'm not getting anything from Axe and Sledge Supplements. Um, I just want to do a review. Because um, I've never tried this before and I'm, and I'm hoping it's as good as I've heard some of my friends say it is. Um, so I just want to go over a couple of the other ingredients that are in here. Um, so of course you have your L-citrulline and your beta alanine and, and you know there's a really good B-complex uh, uh, kind of like mix up in here as well. Um, also you have your niacin in there. Um, you have your um, agmatine sulfate. That one is not too familiar with um, other brands of pre-workouts. It's just a, a uh, it's an amino acid. Um, <clears throat> of course, your caffeine, and then your co your choline uh, bitterate or bitterate or whatever, however you say that. I'm probably butchering the crap out of that word. Um, but that is actually a um, I believe that is another form of a B12 vitamin, and, and if, if I'm wrong, anybody out there can correct me on that. Um, and then you have one here that you don't see often, it's theocrine, which theocrine is actually something that's uh, derived, I believe, out of a, uh, Asian or, or almost a Chinese or Japanese tea. In high doses, it can be a stimulant, but then on the other end, in low doses, it can actually be a sedative. So hopefully there's enough in here where it's more in the range of that stimulant, considering this is a stimulant-based pre-workout. And then you have dicaffeine malate. So that you don't see very often. If you're not familiar with what dicaffeine is, you say, well, it's similar to caffeine. It is, except dicaffeine malate is considered the no-crash uh, caffeine. So if anybody has taken a pre-workout or just an energy drink or something that gives you a really big boost of energy, sometimes there's a big crash that comes along with that a few hours later. So that's supposed to basically, uh, I, I guess, eliminate that feeling and give you nice smooth energy um, through the whole process of this going through your system. So hopefully, hopefully that does that. And then you have another one on here, tooth club moss. So tooth club moss, um, I, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure this is what this is. It's actually um, kind of like a nootropic, so it helps with like your mental focus, your mood, um, and basically um, it derived from a plant, obviously, it's club moss. Um, and of course, Seth Rosie put something like that in there. It sounds like something he'd pull out of his backyard and throw into a supplement, but um, but anyway, I'm, I'm, like I said, I opened this, I was getting ready to, I was getting ready to take a scoop out of it and, and start heading to the gym. But I think what I wanna do is I wanna make a video. So I'm gonna take a scoop now. I'm just gonna mix it together, take a sip, tell you how it tastes. Uh, the flavor of this one is icy, cherry icy. Well, I, as a kid, I've always loved cherry icies. It's got 40 servings for a little container, which is fantastic. So I'm imagining the scoop is probably really small. Yeah, so here's the scoop. So basic size scoop here. So I'm going to just open up my shaker cup here. I'm just gonna pour in some water. Maybe do like a half a bottle of water. Maybe not even that much. Six to eight ounces of water you're supposed to mix it with. That says one scoop. So I'm gonna go with one scoop today and let you know how it feels. I'm gonna put the scoop in. Just gonna mix it up here. Take a chug of it, I guess. I don't like dry scooping. If anybody's out there into dry scooping, I, to me, I, I mean, you may not like me saying this, but to me, it's a little bit of a douchey move. Mix it. That's the, you know, these companies that make these supplements take their time 
in creating these flavors and testing them and tasting them and making sure that they're good when they're mixed with water. Not for you to dry scoop them. It doesn't hit your bloodstream faster than you mix it up and drink it. All right, so let's see. Here we go. Should be mixed well. And take a sip. Cheers. See how it tastes. Actually, pretty good. Yeah, definitely tastes like a um, like a cherry icy. Um, of course, you know it's a pre-workout. I mean, don't expect to have a sugary drink when you're drinking this. But considering how some pre-workouts taste, this one's actually pretty good. All right, so I'm going to finish this up real quick. That's that. And uh, I'm going to see how it feels. So in about... 10, 15 minutes, I'll let you know how I'm feeling. And when I'm done to come home from the gym, I'll let you know how it worked for the workout. All right, check back in in a little bit. All right, so quick update. I just pulled up to the gym. I just parked, letting you know how I feel. So it's been about, I don't know, about 15 minutes away from the gym, so not too far. Um, and I will say that I definitely feel the beta alanine kicking in. I definitely feel the tingles. I feel a good surge of energy. You can probably hear them talking a little bit quicker as well. But uh, yeah, a pretty good, smooth, clean energy so far. So I'm going to uh, get in the gym. I'm going to give it my all and see how long the energy lasts me. I'm typically in the gym about um, about 45 minutes to an hour or so. So um, yeah, see how it goes. I'll give you an update when I'm done. All right, guys, um, back from the gym, uh, showered up, ready to go here, and I wanted to give my, uh, my full review here on how uh, ignition, ignition Switch from Axe and Sledge Supplements uh, felt and worked and what I experienced uh, taking it. So uh, initially uh, did the one scoop, <clears throat> um, about 15 minutes, started feeling the tingly feeling, good smooth energy. Through the workout, I noticed a very clean uh, a clean flow of energy through the whole workout, no crashing, none of that stuff. Um, what I really liked about it too was the mental focus that this gave me. Um, I'm probably still a little bit like energized from it to be honest with you. I mean, it's been what, maybe 40 minutes or so, 45 minutes. Um, didn't do too much of a long workout today. Just wanted to do like a little full body circuit uh, to see how I felt going through this. It's Sunday, so it's typically my rest day, but I wanted to see how this felt. I was a little bored. Um, but yeah, overall, very smooth energy, consistent. Uh, at some points, I, I almost felt like, or normally during uh, a set, you feel like you're getting ready to be a little bit fatigued and you're ready to be done. I felt like I can get, I, I could keep pushing through it a little bit more. So it definitely gave me a little bit more energy um, in that aspect as far as pushing. Um, but yeah, very clean overall. Um, uh, it's, it's a very good product, tastes really good. Uh, so good job there, Axe and Sledge. Thank you, Seth Ferrosi, for continuing to make wonderful products like this. And uh, yeah, uh, until next time, uh, maybe I'll do another supplement review. Um, I take supplements from different companies all over the place, so who knows? We'll uh, maybe see uh, what's the next one I'll do. But uh, until then, um, catch me on the next video. And if you like stuff like this, or if you like reviews on supplements, or you're not sure about which one to take, you could always follow along. Um, but you know, like the video. Uh, hit the subscribe button if you'd like. Um, I got some other videos on my channel that you might be interested in. Um, but uh, yeah, so that's my review on Ignition Switch. Thanks, guys. Have a good one. <laughs>